good food all around the world, but you know what? There's something about Italian. Do you love Italian food? <laughs> I know. So, please welcome the three chefs. We have Massimo Capra in the house, Jason Parsons, Randy Hilton. Fantastic. There's no way we were having a show where we're talking about Italian cooking without Massimo being here. Um, I'm just wondering, has anyone seen Randy? What happened? <laughs> it's behind those masks. What's going on here? Listen, I was told it was the Massimo show, and I was like, I think I could get there. I've been working on this for three whole weeks, yeah. and I thought it'd be curled by now, but it's a big commitment. So yeah. hats off to Massimo because he's got this thing down. There you go. Not bad, man. Oh, I like so much. Like, don't look at mine. Like you can like, get in the light, you can kind of see something. Yeah, a little. <laughs> I see one or two. Yeah, yeah all the peaches Charlie are gone. Brown hairs. Mm, all the peach fuzz. Now we got to start. Start with we got to start with um, you know pasta yes. because you can't think about Italy without thinking about pasta. You know it's a thing of beauty and uh, actually it's my comfort food, right? Yeah, it's my comfort food too. Yeah. And most people's comfort food, but making it from scratch is very different than going to the store and buying a package. There's something about fresh pasta that you know you just can't really you can't get it in a package from the no. store. So let's make it. That's Let's right. not be intimidated. Let's no. try it. Actually, you try it. Why, why, why would that intimidate anybody? All it is is flour yeah. and eggs. Okay, and okay. In, in this case, I mean, we are making egg noodle, which is uh, something I grew up with. Um, most of the rest of Italy actually uses just flour and, and uh, water. Okay. So semolina, flour, and water. Yeah. Um, this is egg noodles. I mean, the, the fettuccine, the tagliatelle, the, mm. the tagliolini. Uh, you see them in That's the supermarket. So yes. Yeah. Yeah. All, all in, yeah, you have to think about it. 100 grams of flour, one egg, one okay. large egg. All right. One large egg. One okay. large egg, okay. So, we get you. You can put it in a bowl just like that. We put three eggs, okay, and it's super simple. See, the great thing about uh, I think making it too is the fact that you get to see what's yeah. in there and realize, yes. like, you know, health conscious, like, this is it. This There's is no it. There's no extra preserved. There's no extra. It's just that. And this is it. Right. Right. Making it in real time as well. Like, it shouldn't take more than five minutes. Uh, yeah. Really? It's, I mean, super it, quick. Because that's it not is. what I would think. I'd think, okay, let me take the next three months to make some pasta. <laughs> <laughs> I've been uh, doing no. that wrong. Well, no. And the first couple of times you do it, it is going to take you a little bit longer because right. you're, not, you're second guessing yourself. Exactly. But really and truly, once you've made pasta, it is that simple. And you know, oh. you're at home and you're thinking, oh, what am I going to have for dinner? Well, mm. quickly put some pasta together. It's not that hard. I want to marry all three of you if you think this is. <laughs> <laughs> Simple little thing I'll whip up on a Tuesday. Having said that, I mean, you get home uh, late uh, after work and all that, you don't want to be mixing pasta up. You can go to the supermarket and buy something yeah, that's really true. good, right? You always have the option, so right, of doing that's both. The, that's the thing. Now, uh, all I've done is I just brought the, the, the dough together, mm -hmm. um, just like that, and then I'm going to start really working it. Okay. okay, with my hands. Work it, and you have to work it with your hands. Now, the best way to do it is to have a wooden board. I have my uh, trusty little uh, pasta board right here. Yep. And uh, I've had this for like 25 years, and I think I'm, gonna, I'm due to get a new one. This exact uh, one? This one here, But yeah. it's doing the job. It actually looks yeah. pretty good. Yeah. And actually, in my area of Italy, which is the north uh, near Milan, mm -hmm. uh, close to Parma and uh, Modena and Bologna and all of that, mm -hmm. um, they sell tables. Your kitchen tables will have a slot to put yeah. the, the, the board in. Oh, nice. Because that's such a that's natural thing. Because that's how common it is. Yeah. doing it every day. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. very cool. And, and funny, mine has a slot in it with drawers where I put the pasta that's already made. <laughs> <laughs> just put the drawers in there. That, I thought that, yours had bacon in it, Jay. Oh, yeah. you, you that's, that's the next drawer down. <laughs> you modern people, eh? <laughs> 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 you young people are all the same. Oh. <laughs> so, the, listen, when you're making pasta, the, that, that, you see how it's coming together? Yeah. 100 grams of flour, one egg. So, 10, 100 grams of flour, which is one kilo, you get 10 eggs, ten right? Eggs. 10 large eggs, normally. It's like that's, a metric that's system. Simple. It just keeps going. Yeah. Yeah. That without a it's incredible, man. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I know. You know, the millennials don't even need a calculator for that. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's why I figured that, you know, with the imperial system, you couldn't yeah. have something so accurate as this. Yes. Okay, because then, then it's too complicated. One ounce and what? The egg is what? Two ounces. Two ounces? Yeah. So okay. you're already already doubled up. You see what I mean? You're messed up. Oh. Way too much math <laughs> happening right now. <laughs> <laughs> So, anyway, okay, so what's happening with that? Dough, yeah? The most yeah. important thing is to just knead it like that. You need yeah. to knead it. You need to mix it well. You need to stretch it because you are realigning all of the, the molecule of the pasta or the mm. flour, okay? So what you want to do is you want to have a dough that is nice and shiny, just like this one. Oh, okay? isn't that beautiful? And we're going to get these boys over here to start rolling up some. Did you, you have to put it in the 
the that fridge is, or anything that. like that when you were done? Did you no, do any of that? but you need to rest it about 15, 20 minutes. Okay. Okay, in yeah. order to have a better product. So I have two doors over here. And All I've right. always wondered why, you know, Italian grandmothers have really strong hands. Yes, <laughs> and biceps. Like, you know, like, Absolutely. Like, oh, you go like this. By yeah. the time I'm you guys are, are finished rolling, okay, and uh, start rolling that piece. Yeah, I get it. I'll yeah, give you another one. For me, Not to right, worry, nice. give you, you some get. too. Here, just flatten it out. So go you ahead. want to take it in little sections now. <laughs> For the, no, but uh, look how easy it is, right? It is. And when, you, when you have a good pasta, you shouldn't need excess flour, okay? Okay. When you have a proper egg noodle, you don't need excess flour. You see that? You, you can roll That's it. That's cool. Oh, you're, you twist. Oh, look okay, you explain, explain the process of what's happening like over there. Yeah, I love the fold. The fold is very important because yeah. what you're doing is you're making the pasta uh, crunchy, okay, mm -hmm. al dente. You're giving it that texture, that crunches under your teeth and uh, it gets really, you know, it has that beautiful, uh, what do you call it? Uh, structure. It's got structure. the snap. Yeah, yeah okay. exactly. It's got the snap, yeah. So you, do you fold it every single time before Great you put it? Great command of the English no. language. <laughs> and the thing too is, I always, um, <laughs> like that. I always go in the way it came out. That's right. So that and way it stays nice straight edges. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. That is good. Oh, this is nice, Master. That is, so that how is many nice. times do you have to do that oh. before you get it to look, the right? Do you want to give me a little bit more? One like more? Seven one on, more. The, um, on the pasta maker. Okay. So you take About it down by one times? number every time? Yeah. You take it down by one or two number in the beginning and then, oh, yeah. okay. Okay. Oh. okay. Oh. okay. Oh. You, you got the bottom Back up a second, boys. Oh, for okay. someone who's never used a machine like that, first of all, what is that machine called? This machine is the classic Imperia machine. It's an Imperia machine. Beautiful. Yeah. And his uh, pasta maker is very popular and very famous all over Italy. Okay. And uh, um, everyone should have one of these yeah. machines. And every household in Italy has a machine like that. Okay. Now, before you cut it into noodles. Yeah. Oh, before you cut. Before you cut it into noodles. <laughs> okay. We, we're gonna don't do it. To we, we're gonna do it because we don't have time to wait. But yeah. the best thing will be to let it dry up a little bit. Yeah. Oh, we okay. don't have time for that. You need now. to let it dry up a little <laughs> but bit. But don't cut it yet. Don't cut it yet. <laughs> wait. 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 You get little pieces like your broom handles and you hang it in the kitchen Bam. and you have it all over and it looks yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I want to know from this machine, how yes. did you know what setting to put it on? So you because just, you can make it very thin. You yeah. can open it up Absolutely. a little bit more. You literally so, just start on the yeah. on the widest one, exactly. and, start you on the start, and then you just down slowly. gradually slowly, and then you bring yeah. it to the thickness you want, okay. right? So All if right. you were going to do a, a lasagna or something, you might do it a little bit thicker. Cut it out. You want I meant really, don't cut <laughs> it yet. <laughs> don't do it no, yet. It. Well, no, because I need more instructions here. What, okay, what instructions okay. do you need? So we made it very now long. I know it's take 30 hours. So it looks like a nylon. So now you need to eat uh, the, the, the noodle according to the size that you want to have it, right? Okay. So. It normally, uh, about half of this will be a good a size noodle. length. Okay, noodle. now you can we, cut we don't, it. We don't it. believe in that uh, hey. business of, uh, of, of uh, leaving it whole. You know what I mean? We don't have nope. to have one single noodle. I mean, like right. in some Asian country, because we've learned how to make this from Asian countries Skinny most likely. Fat. Oh, that's nice you know. to give the credit somewhere yeah, else. You know, I mean, uh, you that's have so, to. That's good of you. Because you can go from Italy all the way to China and uh, so on, and you can find all of the different Absolutely, variations right? of the same thing. Yeah. Well, you know, what it, what we all have it. We all have it in different variations. Skinny or fat? Skinny or fat? Well, I don't know. What What's, you what like? do you? I like fat. Oh yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's so fat. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's talk, girl. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Oh yes. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Yeah, we need to hang them oh, somewhere. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, we, we're gonna make a There's sauce There's something for about it, later, it right? Yeah. That's good. Yeah. yeah, give it up. It's like arts and crafts. That's so cool. Now we need to let them dry, right? Okay. So let's, uh, yep. because I made this pasta last night, right? So what yeah. happens is, when you make it the night before, what happens is it relaxes and it relaxes, it picks up a lot of moisture, right? Right. So the one that I'm making now is perfectly dry and in within five minutes of kneading over here, it's gonna be perfect. You wouldn't need to actually uh, put a little flour on it, right? Yeah. So. Okay, good. But yeah. since that one was yeah, uh, made yesterday. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, yeah absolutely. So, cool. so you decided yeah, how no, thick do or how thin you wanted to make gonna, it. Yeah, it's gonna, if you do a nest right now, it's gonna all get yeah. stuck. He's, made, so he's getting flat, mad at you yeah. right now. That's no, his no, nice no. way of doing yeah, it. Yeah, roll up some more. Um, <laughs> so you gotta dry it. You gotta dry it, and then and then what do we do with it? You're well, ready to you're ready well, to you use boil it. it right you're away. ready to boil it. There's nothing okay. like it. You know the flavor of flour and eggs mm -hmm. with a beautiful sauce, whether it's tomato sauce or cream sauce or. Uh, 
Parmigiano and butter. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, Parmigiano and butter. There's nothing like it. I mean, it's that's it's fresh. universal and fla flavor is uh, or meat sauce. Or meat sauce. Meat sauce. Oh, yeah. good yeah. option.